on this bumpy beer tasting from Smutty Nose Brewing Company out of Hampton, New Hampshire. I have their Key Lime Pie Sour. So the Key Lime Pie Sour comes in at 5.5% ABV, I do believe. ABV is on the bottom of the can, it says. Yes, 5.5%. Uh, this beer is one month old at the time of this tasting. That is the label art. You got the smutty nose seal right there. Key Lime Pie, all the limes. Cool, I like it. Let's go ahead and uh, pour this into my smutty nose shaker glass. As far as I know, I have never done this on my channel. I did uh, research uh, to see if I had uh, any videos up on it, and uh, I do not, as far as I know, uh, unless they were very well hidden. Um, but I have had some sours from them. Uh, some of these may have been rolling over from like the Smut Labs, um, things that they do. I think if it's something that sticks, sometimes they, they come out with a, a full on brew and put it under smutty nose. But the head on that, um, it's kind of uh, fizzing away. It was a white, kind of medium bubbled head. The color of the beer itself is a straw to gold color, and it's extremely hazy. Alright, so for a sour, I mean it really doesn't look all that great. With all the haziness, I would, I would think this one would have been more clear, but who knows. I don't know if they put lactose or anything in there, but the aromas definitely get the lime note coming up. It smells tart. I mean, I get I get the lime out of it. Underlining like a, kind of like almost like a Berliner Weiss type smell. Um, it does say it's a sour ale brewed with key lime puree, vanilla extract, caramel color, and lactose. So there is lactose in there. So okay, that would explain some of the haziness to it. I guess. All right, let's go in for the first swig. Cheers. All right, so base style Berliner Weiss, uh, kind of uh, bready notes um, for the malt. First thing really though is you get a ton of the lime flavor. Uh, it's so strong and almost tastes like a uh, cleaning agent. Um, it's, it's pretty tart, uh, almost going into that full-on sour, but I'm going to say this one's just an extremely tart sour. So after drinking, and then as I, I noticed this last time I just didn't talk about it, I was just going for another swig. Um, but as I talk, I'm getting some of that kind of vanilla sweetness, um, kind of resembles a key lime pie a little bit, but I've had much better, actually the, the two key lime pie beers that I could find on my channel that I've already done, uh, were much better than this one. Uh, it's all right. It's an all right uh, key lime pie sour. I mean, uh, definitely get the lime notes in there. It's um, it's really tart. It's uh, pretty easy to drink. Uh, not my favorite out of um, the bunch that I've had. Uh, so I mean, I'm gonna say this one's it's a good key lime pie sour. Uh, smutty nose. 
I mean, it's decent quality. Uh, when I purchased this one over, the other ones I mentioned, uh, they're in my channel, the ones from, uh, was sent to me from uh, John and Nelly, Georgia Beer Reviews, uh, for Kanza or something like that. It's called, that one's fantastic. And the other one was from uh, Backyard Brewery uh, and their country grandma. Um, and both of those uh, blow this one out of the out of the water. So uh, yeah, it's good. I was gonna say it's good because it just doesn't match up to the the much greater flavored, more hitting the key key lime pie note beers that I have had. This one's just pretty much a lime sour, lime tart, uh, Berliner Weiss type type thing. And the and the lime hits so so strong. It's, almost like a cleaning uh, agent, like I said at uh, the beginning there, so yeah this is Smutty Nose Brewing Company's Key Lime Pie Sour, and it gets a a good score from Bumpy so, cheers and thank you guys for watching